You want the highest quality feed possible for the cows. All our groups of the cows get fed different rations, different amounts of feed, grain to haylage to silage. The face sometimes can get a little grimy just because of the sunlight. It's open to oxygen. Jared cleans off the face on a daily basis. And you want to keep it as tight as possible. That's why we use the rake is that way. You're basically just clawing off as much as you need. Our nutritionist, she comes every two weeks. She checks the cow manure, walks the herd, makes sure everybody looks healthy and uh, helps with our diets. We have a kitchen. Jared was mixing the feed, adding in spent brewer's grain, adding in corn silage and haylage and those all get mixed into a diet. There's a scale on the mixer wagon, and Jared can see how much feed is getting put in. You know, every ingredient has its own weight. You're basically just watching the scale for every ingredient. Everything that you add to the diet will help the cow and produce more milk. Our calves are fed twice a day. They're fed milk, water, grain and hay. And we've noticed a big difference with hay getting fed as they get taller and they develop their rumen faster. Cow comfort is a big key factor here on the dairy farm. We have fans throughout the barn. Those fans are set to a certain temperature on a thermostat. In the summer, we have a sprinkler. Today, we have a bovine podiatrist out and he trims hooves. Every cow gets two trimmings a lactation. We bed with separated solids from our digester, and that separated solids is just like picking up some soil. It's very fluffy and falls through your hand. The bedding, we take cow manure after it comes out of the cow. We take that manure and we put it through what we call a screw press. And that press separates the liquid from the solids. And we take that and we actually put that down for bedding for the cows. So what the cows lay on is a sawdust product that they themselves are creating. 100% sustainable, we do not buy bedding here.